Moses. When it rains, it pours, eh? I've just got a phone call now to go and uh, check out a wombat that's been run over and they reckon it's still got a baby inside its pouch. So um, they hadn't hit it. Obviously, they've come across it. So I just can't believe that people can hit wildlife that size and not stop to either check that it's dead or there's not a baby in its pouch. Like, it doesn't take much to do the right thing, you legends, you know? I'm sure they knew they hit it, but... I'll get up there and see if we can't uh, get him out of the mischief here and no rest for the wicked, I guess. There's been a bit of rain again since we've had the floods. So there's quite a bit of water around, but on yes. See so how we go. Oh, it's just got fur. Oh, well, we got you out, little girl. What nice people that helped me out then. There is some good people in this world, I tell you. Well, that was a fairly successful mission. We ended up getting her out. She looks to be in good order. It just goes to show you if you can get it early and they keep the warmth in, that really tenfolds their chance of survival. So now the hard work begins. When they're this small, they're a bit tricky. It takes normally a, a few days to get them in the swing of things, but um, I've only ever read one or two smaller than this one, but we'll give it a go. I don't know when I'm gonna get some sleep. I might have to tag uh, Ashley in or get Amber out of bed, eh? Now all the, the hard work begins. Uh -huh. Could have been worse, I guess. You can see how big those things are. Like, they're genuinely a massive... That was one of the biggest females, the poor old duck, that I've ever seen, to be honest. Crazy. That's another thing that was a big benefit. Even though she was pretty big and it was hard to get her out of the pouch, at least we didn't have to cut the pouch, because that obviously gets pretty traumatic and puts blood everywhere. So um, that's another big bonus, but... I guess now what we normally do is try and keep them as warm as possible. They generally won't drink anything at the start, obviously, because they're a bit shaken up and got to get used to you. So it normally takes a couple of days to, to get them going, then at least a week to two weeks before they'll start taking the bottle well. So it's just a bit of a wrestling match for the next bloody few days to get them in the swing of things. But, um, yeah, other than that, she should be a little battler. Oh, well, look at her. How does she look? I only seen a little bit of blood. Show me her other front leg. I think it was her mum's blood. Mm, that looks good. It's just a little... Oh, it might be a little bit of skin off, is it? Bruised, bruised maybe. Yeah. Bleeding under the skin. Hey. Oh. You're safe here. Oh. I promise you'll get lots of love. Even though you're going to miss your mum a little bit. We'll get you up and going, eh? Yeah. You wait until Ashley sees you, you'll get smothered in love. <laughs> enjoy your enjoy your first night where you're not getting kissed and cuddled and warmed up. You little battler. Super small, isn't it? You forget how small they are. Fits in the palm of your hand. It's like a little furry potato. No ticks on her. I'm back up at five o'clock this morning, heating bottles up and getting it done. It's a new day, eh? On yours. It's very early for you to be awake. Have a guess what I got last night. Mm. Oops. You can see it's full. Yeah. What is it? Tart. Look, it's in a sock. Maybe is it a wallaby? No. What is it then? It's your favourite animal. What do you think it is in there? Have a look. Look at its little feet. It's hard to see in there though, isn't it? Yeah. What do you think it is now? You can see it. It's a wombo. It is a little wombo. I got her last night and her mum got run over. I just give her some milk. Are you going to be able to help me take care of it? Yeah? Are we going to take care of it for a whole week? <laughs> yeah, well, probably a lot longer than a whole week. Mm. It's pretty cold this morning, isn't it? I just spilt this, milk all over the couch. Dad, what? this cannot go outside anymore. I know it can't go outside anymore. 
She's a little battler, isn't she? Yeah. And her mom got hit by a car. Yeah, her mom did get hit by a car. Hmm? And then I rescued it last night while you were asleep. Ah, oh, crikey, eh? You should make, get a name for her. What do you think? I'm going to call her Lucy Lucy. I think you should have a good think about it and talk to your friends and see, uh, see what you should call her. Because I've got to take her and keep feeding her and get some milk into her, hey? <laughs> oh, you're okay. Sleep back into your little sock pouch, eh? Well, she got a bit of milk into her. There's the first seven mils. Get some milk into you, eh? Come on, you little butler. Been having your milk? Getting a bit in there? You like your little sock, don't you? It's like your mum's. That's, that's good quality merino wool there. You should like it. Nothing but the best. Oh, crikey, Moses. It's 2 a.m. Mm. It's like having another baby. Hey, you're going to slink back into your little sock after you've eaten, drink your milk? Oh, yeah, good night. You're welcome. So unappreciated of you little kids, aren't you? No, no. Mm. <laughs> Who have you got? Stormy. Stormy. She loves her bottle, doesn't she? Mm -hmm. What's the new wombat's name here? Um, it is Miller. Miller. Decided to call this wombat Miller because it came from Miller's Road, didn't it? That's where we rescued it from. From Miller's Road. So little Miller. A little battler just kicking along and hopefully she'll be as big and strong as stormy soon eh on yours tommy's trying to climb up to the couch to see her new little sister yeah hey Aww, he's so cute. this is miller hey <laughs> i kissed her you did do you love her already hey stormy you're going to have to be gentle when she gets a bit older. She's a bit little to play with you because you're a bit boisterous. Tell <laughs> me, that's your little sister. Don't be rough with her. <laughs> don't be rough with your little sister, Stormy. You heard it. Lucky you don't have a little sister because I reckon you'd be really rough with her. I, I would not. <laughs> I think you would. You would have a little sister. I do have a little sister. It's only Brittany. Mm -hmm. Wow. Do you know what I'd have seen then? Yeah, she's chugging it up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, she's chugging it up. I'd have seen that too. She's sucked a little bit more in. Do you know what happens when she keeps chugging it up? She grows big and strong like Stormy and then she can have a play. But me, I have big muscles. Oh, pff, have you been chugging it up, have you? Yep. Big muscles. Pff. Yeah, you're buddy, you're weakling. <coughs> I reckon guinea pig would bash you up. <laughs> Come on, that's it. Start drinking on your own. I'm a bit excited. Oh, there was another one. I'm starting to get excited. That normally takes a week. She's been for two days. Oh, superstar. Hey, guys. And hit the like button to become part of our family. Mm. On ya. On ya.